um, another person may feel is a high risk. And in the context of pregnancy, which is a very dynamic uh, process, where risk can change and where the, the uh, disease process can deteriorate very rapidly, women will, will approach risk in a, in a different way. And I think it's important to take women's viewpoints into consideration when we're dealing with them in, in management of pregnancy. It's their lives that are at risk. And uh, some women will risk anything to have a baby. And for other women, for example, a woman who, who's 40 years of age and has four young children at home and who has diabetes, which is deteriorating and finds herself pregnant and knows that if she continues with the pregnancy, her diabetes will get worse, her eyesight might be affected, her kidneys might deteriorate and so on. For her, that's not an acceptable risk. For a woman who's its first pregnancy, her first pregnancy after, say, years of IVF, she may well be willing to accept that risk. So while we can describe risk as, you know, low, low, middle and high, it's the woman's interpretation of what the risk is to her personally that is critically important in how we deal with women who are pregnant. And that's something that really has to be taken into account.